we start our class, we will decide to do it. Dan dia sendiri yang akan baca doa dan So uh, when I first entered this course, I thought we were just going to learn uh, using whiteboard with physical uh, physical learning. But uh, as I go through uh, the learning process, we also use digital uh, digital learning process such as Cdos. Uh, so every day before class start. Uh, our lecturer, Mr. Dr. Hamiza, will tell us to log in in the website in the CDOS. So, we, me and my classmates will be logging in in the website CDOS. And we went, when we open the website, it's already that, uh, already prepared there. Dr. Hamiza helped us uh, prepare everything in the website CDOS. Actually, CDOS is really easy and it's uh, ready with notes and assessment. So, our work is just to log in and use it. Done the process of table session, and as I, uh, as far as I'm concerned, this activity is really uh, good and significant to be implemented uh, because uh, they can learn how to uh, how to gather with the uh, students, how to do cooperative learning as well as uh, active learning, and also they can activate uh, the process of visiting reporter from one group to another group. Uh, uh, and also, um, furthermore, with these activities, they can create uh, the, their learning, personalized learning, and also they can uh, enhance uh, the, the nurture and passion for the uh, in the future. And also, uh, satu lagi, um, uh, they can gain something new because they can create the creativity and learning with their friends. That's all. Hopefully, they can enjoy and get the good results for the final exam. Thank you for the uh, learning team uh, for giving this opportunity and chance for our class IS2 DVD4 in this uh, uh, program of the Lab competition. Okay, good morning. Today, I'm going to tell about knowledge transfer and active learning. First, knowledge transfer. We can see that uh, our information and our communication skills can be transferred to everyone that uh, can implement the things in our ISMS. So next is the uh, active learning. The active learning part is more important. Actually, it's uh, more important because of if we have the active learning, then only we have the, can gain the knowledge of uh, ISMS. So basically, so the knowledge and uh, knowledge transfer and active learning should enhance the the, the levels of uh, students in their assignments. So that's all from. Me. This activity turned out turned out happy and fun and interesting. Because a lot of ideas were elaborated from others group and this is cool activities. Melalui kaedah pengajaran yang dapat saya belajar semalam, ini dapat memberi banyak manfaat yang kepada setiap belajar untuk mengexpose, mengexplore di website yang ada seperti polisi ini juga dapat membantu belajar untuk lebih memahami sistem yang sebenarnya ini. Ini juga memudahkan belajar untuk kelas yang kerja Dapat beri manfaat dapat belajar. Jadi mungkin kita juga dapat memberi kompas kepada belajar, bersedia belajar untuk memberi. Yeah.